Hi, my name is Emma. I've been attending Calvary Assembly for about three years now, and I am a part of the college ministry here called Outpost. I started attending Calvary back when I was a senior in high school, and that was a really pivotal moment in my life as there was a lot of big changes coming up in my life. Where I was gonna go to college, if it was gonna be close to home, far away from home, what I was gonna be studying, just a lot of big like adult decisions that I was finally gonna have to make. And I'm really grateful I started attending at that moment in my life because a few months later, I really started to question God and not necessarily if he was real or not, but more if he was hearing my prayers because I didn't feel like they were being answered. If he was really there for me, you know, watching out, protecting me because I felt like I was really experiencing a time where I felt alone and like no one was really there for me. I set aside God and my faith for a little bit, not really pursuing much in that. And then I started talking to some of my peers here and some mentors that I had found, really asking those hard questions that I was almost afraid to ask, such as why does God let bad things happen to Christians? As I always thought if I was a Christian, everything would kind of just, you know, pave the path for me and everything would go well. And it was in that moment that I realized that I should not have been mad at God. Like he was not the problem, but he was the one solution I had. And that kind of just changed my whole mindset in which I forgave myself for the way I felt about God. And then, then I started to really pour into serving here at church, which led to me meeting some great people, which I still am great friends with. I'm having those great deep conversations that everyone needs to have, you know, still questioning God, because I think that that's an important part in your relationship is you never want to just be at a base level, but really always just wanting to achieve and learn more about him and his grace. He will always be there for me, and it's just nice to know that he will be the one consistent thing in my life.